more Hong Kongers opting for burial sites in mainland China and the U.S. as a lack of local cemetery space drives up prices. Funeral companies reveal that many of their clients have been looking further afield for their final resting places, as securing an affordable place in Hong Kong can take years. A shortage of burial space in Hong Kong has prompted some locals to opt for a final resting place miles away on the mainland, or even in the United States, according to funeral business operators. The latest trend, which was reported on Friday by burial services companies at the 50 Plus Expo at the Hong Kong Convention and Exhibition Center. Saw an increasing number in of Hong Kongers buying burial plots or niches in Guangdong and San Francisco. Alex Chenkapo, sales director of one of the exhibitors, of the Funeral Business Association, said there were more than about a hundred families buying niche places. On the mainland, since they started selling such services six months ago, he said it took at least three to four years, on average, to obtain a cheap public niche in Hong Kong, and it cost between Hong Kong dollars ten thousand and Hong Kong dollars two thousand each. In private columbariums in the city, he said that their business might be boosted by the government's requirement for columbarium operators to apply for a license. There were a hundred and forty-four private columbariums. Applying for the license by the deadline in March, however, no new licenses have been given to this day," he said. Chen said Hong Kongers could buy memorial tablets at three of their premises in Sham Shui Po, Hong Kong, and Tai Wai, and place the ashes of their columbariums in Guangzhou, Zhuhai. And Si Hui in Guangdong. He said most of their Hong Kong clients had relatives on the mainland, so and they could choose to pay their tribute either in the city or across the border. Chao Po Him, sales manager of the Hong Kong Confucian Buddhist Taoist Ancestral Memorial Hall. Which also sells memorial tablets in town and niches on the mainland, said Hong Kongers might need some years to accept the novel concept of having their ashes stored outside the city. People in the past preferred burial and were strongly against cremation, which was. Now accepted, after years of promotion, he said. He said the tablets cost about Hong Kong dollars eight thousand each, while the niche places, depending on their location, cost between Hong Kong dollars twelve thousand and Hong Kong dollars twenty thousand each. Another exhibitor. The U.S.-based North Star Memorial Group made their first official international promotion in the city after seeing more Hong Kongers buying niches and burial lots in their two most popular properties in San Francisco and Hawaii.
The firm said that among the 50 Asian family clients it had last year, half of them were from Hong Kong, while nine were from Beijing, Shanghai, and Macau. The rest were from Taiwan, Japan, and South Korea. There were only eleven Hong Kong clients in the year two thousand and sixteen. It added the Hong Kong clients usually have relatives or ties in the United States. David Montgomery, vice president for Cemetery Development. At North Star Memorial Group and Eternal Resorts said that Hong Kong families usually do brown burials, even when cremated, since that is no longer available in Hong Kong. The company charges between U.S. dollars six thousand and U.S. dollars twelve thousand for a niche place. And U.S. dollars five at one thousand and five hundred, and U.S. dollars two thousand and five hundred for per square foot for burial lots. It said each niche could accommodate up to eight urns. According to government figures, there were thirty-eight thousand deaths. And thirty-three thousand cremations in year two thousand and five, and the number increased to forty-five thousand and forty-two thousand last year, respectively. As of June sixth this year, there were thirty-two thousand applications for public niches. But the waiting time could be as long as nearly one hundred months, which is more than eight years. It costs two thousand and eight hundred for a standard public niche that can hold more than two sets of ashes, and Hong Kong dollars three thousand and six hundred. For a larger one that can hold more than four sets of ashes. That's the end of the SEMP article. Thank you for listening. Bye.